TRX is big to both the brand as well as the segment because quietly, Ram has established itself as an off-road leader in America with products such as the Ram Power Wagon and Rebel while also allowing our customers to add off-road packages to every trim level. But we've continuously challenged ourselves to exceed our customers' requests for even more. TRX will cement Ram as the premier off-road brand in America. What makes TRX superior to every other high-performance truck on the market is that there truly is no competition. It shatters all paradigms. It's truly transformative. It was designed and engineered bolt by bolt to be the quickest, fastest, most powerful, and most capable off-road pickup truck to ever roll off the assembly line. Now the performance stats speak for themselves. 702 horsepower, 650 pound-feet of torque, zero to 60 in 4.5 seconds. But not to be forgotten that the TRX is tailor-made from the Ram 1500. So not only will it offer premier off-road capability, but it will also offer segment-leading luxury and technology as well. Because our brand is solely focused on building trucks, since the Ram Truck brand became a standalone brand, the fact is we've had the, the name in our stable for quite some time, and we've just been waiting for the right time to use it. Our fans and customers have had quite a bit of fun uh, regarding the name, and they've reminded us that the T-Rex was the apex predator in the Jurassic era. So it feels right bringing the apex predator into market should carry that name and establish its supremacy in the marketplace. The Ram 1500 TRX is equipped with a 6.2 liter supercharged Hemi. The similarities between the Dodge Hellcat engine and our 6.2 supercharged for the TRX are vast. We, we continue to use the cast iron block, the forged steel crank, and the aluminum heads of the base engine. We've modified only the things that we had to to adapt to this application. We changed the oil pan to a deep sump truck oil pan that keeps the uh, pickup tube in the oil in all circumstances, uh, high G uh, corners in the Baja environment especially. The uh, alternator was also moved higher on the adaptation of the front end such that we could get a 32 inch uh, water fording depth. To prepare the powertrain for extreme desert enthusiasts. We took a holistic approach, understanding what the customers expected with customer surveys, data acquisitions, and a lot of hands-on real-world testing. The airbox for the 1500 Ram TRX is specifically designed for Baja environment. It is separate from the engine, hovering above the engine so it never it, it doesn't follow the vibrations of the engine. It has two 8 by 12 inch air filters that capture four times the dirt of our closest competitor. In addition, it has two airflow entries, one through the functional hood scoop and one of ram air from the, the front of the grill. So it always gets cool, clean air to the supercharged hemi. What differentiates the Ram 1500 TRX from a standard Ram 1500? Under the skin is just about everything. We start with a strengthened frame made of up-gauged, up-yielded materials, all developed to withstand the rigors of everything we can throw at this truck. To that frame, we bolt longer forged aluminum control arms up front, longer stamped steel control arms out back with our five-link suspension, taller springs, and our Bilstein adaptive dampers. This vehicle is really made to face any obstacle it comes across without demanding any compromises of the driver. The rear axle on the Ram 1500 TRX is basically set up to take a direct missile strike. It is essentially me, my weight, tacked onto a standard Ram 1500 axle. The Dana 60 has got a 10 inch ring gear, massive floating axle shafts. Essentially it is designed and has proven itself in durability to be able to survive anything both a punishing customer and a daily driver could throw at it. 
What we've achieved with the Ram 1500 TRX is a suspension setup that allows us to tie the vehicle down to the pavement when the customer wants to drive hard on terra firma, but also allow travel and plushness over any undulating terrain, over dunes, over rocks, through rivers. This suspension setup has what it takes to overcome all obstacles. The durability of the Ram 1500 TRX required everything that we do on the standard Ram 1500 plus the additional high-speed off-road element. The Extreme Off-Road Cycle is a new cycle specifically developed for this truck. It includes a brand new facility at, at our proving grounds to punish the truck as, as a customer would in the real world. Similar to the, the base Ram 1500, we subject the vehicle to all environments, uh, including cold, hot, high altitude, and in our case, all high-speed off-road uh, desert driving. We took the vehicle to Glamis, California, spent times in the hot heat of, of Southern California doing dune climbs and dune running, bull running. Uh, spent time at the uh, dunes in, in Michigan as well for a, a different experience. In this truck we also have a rock mode, so we wanted to make sure that we were excellent for the four low experience. Took the truck to uh, sites in Michigan and as well as uh, Moab, Utah, pushing the truck through what a standard Jeep or off-road truck would, uh, would see in the most extreme rock climbing conditions. We put the Ram 1500 TRX through as many off-road situations as we could to make sure that it exceeds the customer's expectations. With TRX, uh, we were able to bring in a bunch of new uh, driver-focused technologies. Uh, first off is our brand new HUD, or head-up display which allows uh, the customer to see a, a really a full color 10.1 inch uh, display that's seamlessly floating out on the, uh, the hood of the truck. Uh, it offers uh, simple, standard, advanced modes um, as basically modes that you can get into right when you jump in the truck, but then you can actually go in and select a custom mode which allows users to have between two to five different types of settings uh, displayed in that cluster. With our uh, new uh, Uconnect touchscreen for the 12-inch uh, on-RAM TRX, we're really able to kind of utilize the space. TRX um, obviously gave us this opportunity to combine both performance, off-road pages, and then incorporate our eight drive modes as well as valet into a really nice seamless approach. Uh, you can use swipe left and right to kind of go through those different screens. This is the Halo product for RAM, uh, as well as an FCA products in general. We developed three different interiors within TRX. We start off with our TR standard interior, which is our vinyl cloth interior, a little bit no frills in that sense, meant to get dirty. Then you step up to our TR2 price class. Really, this is where it opens the door for all of the, the content that we bring into the vehicle. With this price class, you can bring in your heads-up display, you can bring in your digital rear view mirror. You can bring in carbon fiber. Also our TRX red accent color package. There's a whole host of features and a lot of them are standard features. I, I love the fact that we were able to bring in a flat bottom performance uh, steering wheel, but not just that, we were able to bring first time for Ram paddle shifters uh, for the steering wheel, which is a really, really nice feature. On top of that, we've been able to bring in our center console mounted uh, floor shifter which is a really nice feature. Uh, we've displaced the rotary shifter, brought it down to the center console, and actually gone in and added drive modes and a few other things like launch control uh, to that area where the rotary shifter used to be. Little details like uh, red behind the speaker grills to give a little bit of that accent color popping through with our Harman Kardon 19 speaker system, I think is a pretty cool detail. Also the center console badge. Uh, where we kind of go in and, and bring in the VIN number of the vehicle, our horsepower, boost ratings, 
those are just little jewelry type aspects which I think you just you, you fall in love with these details and I think that's really what helps sell uh, sell a vehicle. Form always follows function in performance vehicles. The TRX off-road obviously is the epitome of that. So definitely, uh, um, you know, the, the performance aspect, making sure that the vehicle has all the attributes functionally and aesthetically that, that we can incorporate into them. Designing the TRX versus a, a, the Ram 1500, just the inherent proportion, the track, the wheelbase changes, the size of the tire all helped create the proportion of the vehicle that created this um, outstanding package, something that really is going to stand out on the road beyond what the Ram 1500 already does. But one of the most impactful things of, of the TRX is the proportion of the face. The vehicle is eight inches wider, 88 inches wide overall. We take in a lot of air through the grill. The, the hood with the intake, we take another 50% of the air in through that upper grill as well. So it's, it's that, that, that proportion that the face of that vehicle has, but it's also functional. One of the things that I personally like about the Ram TRX is that typically a, a truck, you know, a relatively flat body side to it, especially if you're looking at it into a top view. The TRX has such wide fenders, uh, both front and rear, that the, the vehicle takes on a completely different type of stance to it. One of the, the coolest parts about the face of the, the TRX to me is the, the air curtain uh, design. You can stand at the, the front of the vehicle next to the headlamp or right behind the uh, front wheel looking forward and you can see the air curtain, the fact that it's actually open all the way to the front and rear. There's nothing like, it, like that out there and I think that's just a, a great testament to that form and function working together. If you look at the rear of the vehicle, it still has that wide stance that the face has. Um, it's complemented by five inch exhaust tips uh, through the bumper. We have uh, tow hooks uh, on all four corners of the vehicle. We have a Ram Mopar step assist as well. Uh, and then obviously we have our optional wheel with beadlock capabilities. I think Ram TRX buyers are, are going to be uh, very happy with the fact that the vehicle stands out as, as much as it does on the road compared to other, you know, other trucks that are out there. There's nothing like it and it has an incredible presence to it. The main challenge of designing the 2016 concept truck was the timing from when we were initially given the green light to do it to the show, which was the State Fair of Texas in October. So we had about 77 days to build that truck. Um, and I'm you know, really proud of that because not only did we build an awesome concept truck, but uh, as PDO, we were actually able to put a stake in the ground for both engineering and design as to what the truck should be. So we, we learned quite a few things from the concept that uh, guided us on the production truck. So. One of the, the big ones was the need to shift the wheelbase forward by about 20 millimeters. So uh, early on in the development on the concept truck, we knew that to fit this larger tire OD with all of this added suspension travel, we had to move that axle forward. And that was one of the, um, the early discoveries that we knew was gonna be a challenge on the production truck, but it, it prepared everybody in the team for what needed to be done. Some of the learnings that we had from the uh, concept truck that made their way into the production truck um, were obviously how to get the functional hood scoop uh, feeding that big 6.2 supercharged V8. So part of uh, the form following function aspect of the truck was really how do we make that real? You know, we knew that we were going to need plenty of power, plenty of uh, breathability into that engine. One of the things that we sort of changed going from concept to production was that instead of playing up that that high monolithic grill we ended up going to this full-on wide graphic right to uh, the truck's 88 inches wide so we wanted to make the truck read as wide as possible so you'll notice that we went from the hop up to basically a flat brim graphic all the way across the front of the trucks so from, from concept to reality, for this particular program, for TRX, it's been an awesome journey uh, as a design manager, as a designer, with working with such a talented team, both on the design side and the engineering side. It's a tight-knit team. The thing I was most proud about was that um, we were really able to keep 
all of the essence that made the show truck so awesome and, and transfer it into the production truck with really almost no compromise at all.